This is Coyote News. On Saturday, the USD track and field team was in Brookings for the Jim Emrich Invitational. The women's team finished on top of an eight-team field with 198.5 points, which was 50 points more than second place NDSU. The men's team ended the day with 125 points, which was good enough for third place. The Coyotes won 10 of the 32 combined events between the men's and women's teams. Aaron Kinney and Holly Gerberding each won two different events for the Yotes as Kinney took home the women's 60 and 200 meter races, breaking the USD 60 meter program record and Gerberding finished on top of the long jump and 600 meter leaderboard. USD pole vaulters put their name at the top of the standings with the Coyotes finishing first through sixth in the women's division and the men's side saw freshman Spencer Bewley and the day th three on the podium. The track and field team will be back in Saturday um, in the Lincoln, Nebraska for Adidas Classic. Landon DeBoer is live in the muck with Erin Kinney to discuss her milestone run. Landon? Thanks, Hannah. I'm here with Erin Kinney, the fastest woman in coyote history. I was wondering how you plan on building off of your recent success, Erin. Um, I just kind of go into my races with the mindset that I can beat my PR and I think going forward I just want to train hard and hopefully lower my record. And how does your preparation differ from say the 60 meter to the 200 meter events? So the 60 is mainly block start so I've been working a lot of technique with my coaches and I think going forward I need to work more endurance for the two and more technique for the 60. And is there any pregame rituals that you have to get ready for meets or any extra mental preparation you do before meets? Um, before meets, I just kind of like to warm up by myself and not really think about things and just try to keep my nerves very low. Well, thank you for being here, Erin. Thank you. Live in the muck for Coyote News, I'm Landon DeBoer.